We have traveled all the way to Holland to spend 24 hours with Winhof, aka the, the Iceman! Where are we, guys? We're gonna see the main man, the man of the ice. I'm buzzing, yeah. Wild. Not as, buzz, not as buzzing as Big Comet is. No comment. Maybe he's outside here. What car are we looking for? A brown van. Hi, Wim. What? Oh, man. How are we? Good to see you, brother. How are we doing? Oh, <laughs> nice to see you. Yeah, bro! <laughs> Amazing! <laughs> oh, I feel great uh, in your presence, guys. Oh, likewise, likewise. It, it is Luke and... Tom. 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 Tiny Tom. What? <laughs> Tom. Tiny Tom. <laughs> Tom means T-O-M. It yeah. means... Uh, Tiny, oh mother, uh, you know, little baby, this is, uh, this is tiny, oh mother. <laughs> when I became 60, I went 60 minutes into icy water and had a very nice party, you know, cool party. I was the cherry on the ice cake, something like that, you know. And then 61, 61 minutes, 62, 62 minutes, etc. When it, uh, I arrived at 64, which I am right now, and I said to myself, ah, it's boring. I don't need to do that anymore. If I want to, I can do 164 minutes. Just to show that an older man is gonna be fucking strong. Why? Because he is in control of his spirit. Because he believed. We're gonna talk about these things all. New insights that stir up the people, invigorate the people to believe that there is a different paradigm that enables every person in the world by the laws of nature to become happy, strong and healthy. Isn't that love? And we are going to show it through science and through sense, common sense. There we are. Have a great day. <laughs> <laughs> we are nearing the place. Yeah, <laughs> here. here it starts. Wow. It doesn't look like the Iceman's home, eh? Wow. It's more like a uh, barley. This was a former metal company, and I changed it into this. Wow. Because I love plants. I love gardens. Nice, guys. Nice to have you here. <laughs> oh. Wow. We go later over there. This greenhouse. It's a, yeah, a greenhouse. Wow. This root. Hi, brother. Yeah, good. Wow, look at this place. Oh yeah, I'll show you the room. I yeah, open the doors. It's <laughs> oh, not like uh, oh, oh, thank you. It's this one. Oh. Sh shall we have a little tour? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. yeah. Oh. yeah the, I love plants. They're fishy. That's yeah. Smart, eh? See the, yeah, yeah, little bananas come. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Oh. Gee. Hey. You just come out here and watch them, huh? Yeah. Yes, yeah. Mesmerizing. Yeah. We do the practice. Whoa. The retreat. Whoa. The yoga mats and people breathe and do exercising. All here. Me and Rudy, we play the... the uh, come on, Rudy. Let's play. <laughs> I mean, brothers, brothers. <laughs> Like thick, yeah. like, like wool. Wool is inside. <laughs> 
the Nadara jungle here. In the Netherlands, the other one, I have some block. Later, got a jump. Yes, it was a former metal company. Okay. These are obsidian, which is volcanic. Whoa, look at this one. <laughs> like this. Whoa. Nice, eh? Just Whoa. to inspire. Does it get warm in here in the summer? No, no, no. no. Just cool. Just cool. That is the sauna. It's only 48 degrees. And we have talks here. And it goes to double the temperatures, 110 degrees. It will go. This is where the where our spirits meet. Because I've been gone past the pain. If you go into the cold, you learn to deal with pain. You go to, through the initial stressful response. And it's painful. But then suddenly a bigger power uh, is awakening inside and that is able to go past the pain and then you learn to have connection with the opioids in your own body so let's teach this to the people in the world so the opioid crisis and people with pain no longer need to resort to something uh, that is going to give a lot of side effects a lot of suffering and no solution we are able to bring it down where it should be. Uh, I'm very good at the dumbbells. They say this is the Hanuman Asan. Uh, 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 that is a yogic exercise coming from, uh, there was a war with Sita and Rama and Sita got wounded. And so the Hanuman, this ape god, he went with big steps to the Himalaya to get the top, the summit of a mountain full of the herbs with the medicinal properties. And he brought that, he is very strong. He's strong like uh, Tom, you know, in the mythology, but he is real. Uh, thing is, he brought it back with the big steps. That's why it's called Hanuman Asana. But I call it, keep your balls on the ground exercise. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Try. Hey, hey. Oh, look at you, Tom. Oh, yeah. Looks good, man. Yeah. Do you like yes. it? Yeah, it's yours. Oh, yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love to see you there sometime on Instagram. Yeah. Oh, I want to be waiting all the time. Bye bye. Film this. It's important because I'm in the film. No, no, no. <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> yes, I'm not into that. <laughs> the energy level of these men and me myself comes from going out of normal conditioning. We need drugs, we need food, we need this, da, da, da. all these extra things because we do not feel our power. Once you feel full of energy like this, I eat once a day because I don't need no more. I'm breathing. I take the exchange of energy like the solar panels outside. We got that power. All what has been created in technology, we actually comes from our minds. That means we got that inside of us. It's just duplicated what is already inside. Nice uh, talk. Hey, W H. Let's oh. swim up, man. <laughs> yeah. After them, after them. I tell you, I get them. <laughs> it's my home. <laughs> <laughs> It's majestic. Oh, oh. Two kings. <laughs> Three kings. Three kings. First cold water dip of the day. Born ready. Kilimanjaro between five to nine days. In five to nine days, only 40% summit. 
in clothes. Now this guy, 76, without former experience in mountaineering, suffering from Lyme's disease, he was going to do it, in short, in 31 hours. And now his Lyme's disease is totally gone. He's healing people because he found back his connection with nature. My oldest participant is 101 years old. <laughs> And she, uh, she loves it so much, she told her sister, 99 years old, <laughs> they are doing it. Not to be in an elder home. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, be strong. Yeah, we get into the sauna now, which is nice. And then uh, it's time for you to jump from the rock. <laughs> 11, 12, 16, 6, 7, 8, 14, 14. There was a guy, he told, uh, he said, Wim, um, uh, I said, yeah, nobody has beaten me with uh, my, the dumbbells. I did 444. I thought it was a nice number. <laughs> and then he did 445. Oh. And then uh, the other day I came and then I did 888. <laughs> and then he said, oh, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> we are strong. Wow. What do you think? The cold makes you strong. strong. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Watch your master at work. <laughs> yeah, there he is. <laughs> Shall we go into the sauna? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, yeah. A little bit like uh, tea water. Yeah, that's, nice. ah. yeah, that's good. Yeah, Rudy is coming. <laughs> hey, Rudy! The thing is, with the cold, it brings you back to your true nature. And then you don't forget your mother. Mm -hmm. You don't forget your beloved, mm -hmm. like I did. It gave me, every time this grounding, the cold there brought me that silence, that peace, and that way I began to heal. And then I saw the power of it, by <coughs> which my agony was a moment oh. gone. Not, not the memory, the yeah. memory is there. And my wife is here yes. in the rock now. Yeah. Yeah. She looks like a Mary with a hoodie yes. on and a little child in the arm. She is always here. Your mother is here. Yeah. Yeah. Souls don't die. They ever last. But do we understand that? They are unbreakable. So is your mother's soul. So is my wife's soul. So are the beloveds around me. My mother, my father. They're all here. It's only because we live in a society where uh, we say that is the end. No, it's not the end. And now I want to feel why I am here, what is my soul, what is my mother, my father, my family, and how to be. We bring the light, man, and how sometimes I don't know, then I just do it. Whoa! I should have brought the bigger rocks! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Time to save it all! And then it's cold and Just happy and healthy. Happy I don't have healthy. to talk about the strong. 
Imagine if the people take on cold therapy as much as they need. Killer number one in our society is cardiovascular related diseases. Kills millions of people. If you do this, it's gone. Of course, that's not interesting for an economy based on sick people. It's a healthy economy on sick people. It's sick. But this will turn it. I call it the ostrich. Let me do 50 times or something. 50? Yeah. Well. I'm sure I will be your wealth, there's no more. It is no do the breathing we follow the breath suddenly the breath holding it and manipulating it after exhalation that means suddenly the body is not breathing and the deep brain the reptilian brain is a reactionary it's a, it's a oh, no, it's not breathing what's happening adrenaline shoots out all over the body five times more blood will flow into the heart and into the brain more adrenaline than a person who goes for the first time into a bungee jump. Let's just do it. There's a lot more to tell about this, but we are just going to do it. Luke and Tom, very much welcome. We have to show the world that the real power is within. They are the ones to make that understood because they got the power all out, but now in. Belly in. Chest, let it go. Holy, let it go. Holy, let it go. Holy, holy, let it go. Holy, let it go. Holy, go. Holy. Let it go and stop. There's no need for breathing. Gotta save the soul! Still no need for breathing! One minute without breathing! Blood is flushing into your heart and into your brain all day! All day! Three, two, one! Overriding the body. We are meeting with the soul, our consciousness, in Tom, in Luke. Both is there, into the depth. What is what you wish? What is what you want to retrieve from the depth inside? Hold on! Squeeze up!
and stop. By manipulating the life force, the breath, we are able to overwrite the normal physiology, to retrieve that what is stored in the depth of our bodies. Could be of this life, of yesterday, last year, 10 years ago, or in another life. Just try it out once and feel for yourself. There is no doubt there. Just healing. One, two, four, one. Let it go. Let it go. Message is clear. Make music, it's like a little bit tribal, but the serious message is you are able to retrieve what you normally in your daily life get stored deeply within your own body, which you could not process. You feel liberated, cleansed, cathartic. You feel better. Well done. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. Oh yeah. Oh. Shit. Good. Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. 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 Giving it all, getting it all. <laughs> I think one chopped my legs off. I can't move. Imagine if we do this like double amount, we really go even deeper. Oh. Initially, straight after, it was like an outer body, like our body's just a vessel. Oh, everything's light, nothing. You have no, like, there's nothing there now, if that makes sense. There's nothing. No thoughts, no processes, no nothing. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what it is. I'm just here. Yeah, like so it's like the soul's left your whole body when you wake up, and you can't feel your legs. Everything feels it just feels like you're floating. But yeah, that's one of the most coolest and weirdest experiences of my life. I've never been so deep in my mind, and I've never done any of that breathing stuff before. And that's unbelievable what your breath can do. And, when you have control of your mind, but yeah, I woke up and holy crap, like that was, yeah, that was intense, but it was unreal. Like, like your body's just this vessel, like our body is just like this, but the real stuff is like in, in here, in, in your head, your, your mind, your, that's where the deep so stuff comes look from. Look after your yeah. body, look after your mind, and this stuff is powerful. I didn't realize it was this powerful until, oh, oh wow, any six Gs up. Imagine if it went even deeper, I'd be <laughs> floating on the roof. We might never get him back. <laughs> what an experience. Hey, what an experience to do it with my little brother. Hey, hey. hey. <laughs> uh, wow, it's powerful. <laughs> He's a crybaby. Um, fuck. Jeez. Intense, but oh, so good. So, so good. I tried to get up straight away. <laughs> My legs <laughs> I was stuck to the ground. <laughs> you don't pay anything for breath. You don't pay anything to be cold. You don't pay any money. 
Tom is the strongest man in the world and one of the strongest men in the world. But without our emotional strength, without our pure strength, then we have nothing. We have absolutely nothing. So this being here today is making all that just 100% true because it's something that we practice back home very, very much. And being here with one um, and letting us in here is, is truly one of the most amazing experiences of my life. And I'm um, eternally grateful for you. Thank you. If the strongest man in the world is trying to do this stuff, physically the strongest man in the world, why would someone else not watching this? Why would you not try it? Why would you not try it? That's my question to anyone that watches this. Why not just try it one time? It could change your life. It could make you see things so much differently. The mess, the, uh, the noise. I need to do this. I need doesn't need to be noisy, it can be quiet, it can be peaceful, it can be simple. The cold is simple. Breath work, oh, powerful. <laughs> I don't know wearing this, this is what our mum used to wear, uh, this type of stuff, and uh, she would be so happy to see us here, I think. Yeah. I think that's like, oof, that's, yeah. yeah. Funny ah, Tom and Luke. Man. Man. Two ha motherfucking handsome guys. <laughs> Man, if I was a homosexual, <laughs> you, you know? I, I, but I can appreciate, I can appreciate uh, beauty. <laughs> Handsomeness is great, it's beautiful. Life should be aesthetic, because life is an art. Whoa. I cherish this one, man. There you go. Young puppy. <laughs> hey. oh, is that mum? This is mum, yeah. Me. me here carrying Tom. Maybe not so able to carry Tom. Now. What kind of breed is this? <laughs> That's Scottish beef. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I believe. Mum again. When, when did it start, the muscle thing, you know? When, I was, when did you feel it? Kind of round about. Ah. <laughs> when I was 16. Oh, wait. This is our opa. Uh, ah. Polish, ah. He was Polish. Yeah, our granddad, yeah. Or, uh, Dominic. 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 Yeah. yeah. He was a very, very hard working man. Very, like. Yeah, like stoic. Yeah, yeah. very stoic. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. They don't do uh, argument. No. They just uh, deliver the yeah. work silent and well. Yeah. Mysteriously good. Yeah. Every day is an enlightening day. Because I, I experience everything much more now after having kids of 40 and uh, 38 and all, and studied and having get, uh, gone through the, the suicide of my wife mm. and being alone with them, I can appreciate, I, uh, deeper than where I was, that you cannot do, or, or, you, go, or, or you die, mm. you know? But uh, it's not my time, it's, uh, I had to serve my kids. Yeah. I see you tomorrow. Yes. yes. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Have man. a good sleep. Yes. A good sleep is a blessing. Tomorrow. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Amazing. Amazing. Thank amazing. You. We had a good time. Yes. It's really yeah. memorable. <laughs> Bye, Wem. See, see you later tomorrow. Cheers. Thank you for the day. Thank you. See you later. Bye. Okay. That's Wem gone. We have Wem's entire house to herself. Let's go explore. Ah, oh, 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 oh. Is it high up there above the salty seas? Crazy little monkey. Ah! 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 Dinner time! Veggie rice, Tom. Some rolls. It's like an egg kind of omelette. Oh. Mm. Right, guys, that is me exhausted. It's been a busy day. I'm off to bed. What a fun day it was. We will see you tomorrow. Good night.
Quando me está a lembrar-te amor Se eu tenho a doce No, they move themselves. Come! Hello. Come! Meet my friends! Let's make it beautiful! Really tiny there. Thanks, boys. So, what's that happening right now? I think I'm just doing a photo shoot for some uh, Australian brand that he works with. I mean, this is random. We wake up and we're expecting Winhoff to come and fucking four busloads of people are coming. <laughs> One, we love you. Yes, hello! Hi, nice to meet you. Hey, nice to meet you, yes! <laughs> hey, how are you? Hey, hey, hey Yay! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> my hey, God! Nice to see you. How you doing? I'm oh, 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 my God, you're here! Oh, my God! All right, I feel my core now. Beautiful. Ah! Oh, wow. That's good. Nice. Oh. Nice. Oh, that's so impressive. Wim. That was my technique, Wim. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> yeah. Whoa! They're going to fancy me up. I love the yellow and the black. Funny, eh? It's a carnival. Life is a carnival. Good. <laughs> Got the, all the moves. Oosh, oosh, oosh. Whoa! Oh, hola! Because my feet a little bit here, then I go like that. Yesterday he, he took from the garden shop just one package of seeds, really? sunflowers. That's just so weird. Yeah, yeah. So and here they are, and here Usually they are. We've got sunflowers. Oh, oh bro! Uh -huh. That, oh, that gives me shivers, man. Yeah. Sunflowers, sunflowers, ah. sunflowers yeah. in the garden. Ah. Sunflowers, sunflowers. Whoa. <laughs> wow. Wow. What was... I bowed to that. It's no coincidence. Yeah. We're all wearing sunflowers for your mom. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you have more tattoos or sunflowers as well. Yeah, wow. Whoa. I guess unconditional love. I think with more people, you have, you have more of an experience of the energy between people. And I honestly cannot believe that this is happening today. Like, we came in, obviously we knew we were coming to see one, but then to experience this with these guys. And yeah, I feel very fortunate to be here today. <laughs> Yeah! 
I am so bloody delighted they, uh, to meet these beautiful human beings. They're very impressive. I've, I've met so many people, and then I, I see that uh, it's like I see a piece of the art of nature. I love it. And the mother, they loved the uh, sunflowers. And, uh, and my son, to, uh, uh, yesterday, he, uh, we went to a garden center and he just took uh, seeds. Of all the thousands of uh, possible packages, he took uh, the, the sunflowers. He, and he showed me, but, but look, beautiful flowers. It's, a, it's like the message. And that is, uh, uh, it sounds very esoteric, etc. Why is it that so that we have the understanding that our people who pass over are still connected? Why is that so mysterious? I tell you, it's here. And as it is here, they came from Australia with all kinds of dresses full of sunflowers. Was it me? Yeah, dresses and, uh, and pantalons and, and shirts, all in sunflowers. And that on Sunday. And uh, 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 the, this is my family now. The future is ours. Are you in? Let's go. They're amazing. <laughs> we are like family. <laughs> Asking me, but I don't know. That is as much as I know. I know. Greetings. Was a wonderful and <laughs> was magic. Yeah. <laughs>